the 2022 Survivor Series War Games pay-per-view has come to an end. But there are two huge stories coming out of this pay-per-view. First, something very tragic and upsetting happened with Rhea Ripley. Rhea Ripley was on the Bailey team and she was being touted as the unstoppable force in the match. And even though Becky Lynch returned to WWE, Rhea Ripley was the odds-on favorite to come out the strongest in this pay-per-view. In fact, it has leaked that Rhea Ripley was supposed to pin Bianca Belair and Team Bailey was supposed to win and Rhea Ripley would begin her feud with Bianca Belair in her quest to become the brand new Raw Women's Champion. But unfortunately for Rhea Ripley, that did not happen. Instead, she was embarrassed on live TV when she got misted by Asuka. Bianca Belair and Becky Lynch's team won the match, and Rhea's team lost. After her match ended, she went backstage and cried as she tried to get the mist off of her face and out of her eyes. No word whether her boyfriend, Dominic Mysterio, was backstage with her. This was a very sad pay-per-view for Rhea, but her fans are hopeful that she can rebound and still continue her quest to become champion. In the other War Games match, Roman Reigns' team of the Bloodline took on the Brawling Brutes team. But, unfortunately, it was not all smiles for Roman Reigns and his team, even though the Bloodline won. The threaded storyline in this match was, can Roman Reigns trust Sami Zayn? In the end, he could, and they ended up winning the match. But just prior to the pay-per-view going off the air, Roman Reigns and Sami Zayn shared a very sad moment in the middle of the ring as Roman wrapped his arms around Sami and hugged him tightly. Why did this happen? Well, in part, it was supposed to be part of the storyline that Roman can now trust Sami Zayn. But it was also because Roman was very sad in the moment because Roman is not going to be on WWE TV until January of next year as he is going to take a vacation from WWE. This is because of Roman's part-time contract, and in a way, he was passing the baton to Sami Zayn, as this is going to be the winter of Sami Zayn, as Roman Reigns will be nowhere to be found. However, Sami Zayn will keep carrying the Bloodline torch, and Sami will be the de facto head of the Bloodline until Roman returns in January, but for now, it's very sad that Roman will not be on WWE TV until the Royal Rumble pay-per-view. What are your thoughts about Rhea Ripley and her team losing and her being embarrassed, so much so that she cried backstage? And what do you think about Roman Reigns taking a leave of absence and saying goodbye to WWE until next year? Leave a comment below and give me your opinion. And don't forget to subscribe and click the bell notification so you are notified when we upload a new video.